Hello everyone, we hope you're having a great day today. It's time to spill some tea on one of the best series on CBS, Blue Bloods. The show is about to welcome its 12th season, and we cannot wait to have more family dinners with our beloved cast. Directed by David Barrett, Blue Bloods is a crime series with a strong cast including talented actors such as Tom Selleck, who plays the part of Frank Reagan, Donnie Wahlberg as Danny Reagan, Bridget Moynihan as Aaron Reagan, Will Est as Jeannie Reagan, Len Carew as Henry Reagan, Sami Gale as Nikki Reagan Boyle, Marissa Ramirez as Dead, Maria Baez and Vanessa Ray as Officer Eddie Janko. Apart from these main cast members, we expect to see some regular names of the show returning to the series in its 12th season. Some of these names are Abigail Hawk, Gregory J. Barra, Robert Cloessi, Stephen Sherpa, and Andrew Tereciano. The show, which is known for its magnificent family dinners, and if season 12 evolves according to our expectations, we can anticipate having a 250th family dinner with the Reagans. The new season is scheduled to be aired on October 1, 2021, and if pandemic circumstances wouldn't interrupt the usual production process, we will have 22 episodes of the show just like the previous seasons. Despite the fact that there are only a couple of weeks left till the new season, the official trailer of this 12th season of the show is still yet to be released. Still, there are some leaks from the first episode of this brand new season, which would ease our curiosity in the absence of a new trailer. According to the leaked information, Callie Thorne will return to the show for this first episode as a psychic medium. She will be reached by Danny, who is seeking help to solve the murder of a boy. While Danny is busy with that, Frank falls into a disagreement with the mayor. The two have conflicting approaches when it comes to protecting the city, which became more apparent following the shooting of a high-profile figure upon a massive rise in the number of crimes. Aaron, on the other hand, dives into a cold case that took place decades ago and was witnessed by her boss, Kimberly, when she was just a girl. The name of the episode is expected to be Hate is Hate. The showrunners seem quite confident in this new season and what they achieved with the character developments. Previously, the executive producer Kevin Wade told the TV Insider that the main thing that we try to do every season is to take our characters a year older, a year wiser, in some cases a year less cautious, and let them loose right to those actors. We have to give them new dimensions every year because they need something to play that they haven't played before. After a two hours long roller coaster of a finale season, at the end of season 11, fans of the show are also quite excited for the season 12 of Blue Bloods. In the finale episode, Danny learned that Joe Hill was loaned out to the ATF for an undercover mission. This brand new information came in last minute as he was about to shot Joe. Throughout the episode, we watched Joe doing his best to assist Danny through some clues. In the end, we got to see the big action scenes that we love so much as Reagan's faced criminals. What do you think of Blue Bloods? Are you a dedicated fan of the show? Who is your favorite Reagan family member? Let us know in the comments below and don't forget to like, subscribe and share the video. Thank you for watching. See you soon.